Hi everyone. Welcome to Wednesday Wine and Word. Uh, episodes brought, brought to you by Legacy of Love Coaching by LaShawn. And yes, I am LaShawn. Uh, within these uh, Wednesday Wine and Words, we're going to like talk about all sorts of things. My my mantra is live, laugh, love. So I kind of want to keep it in that era. So we'll talk a lot about life. Um, life things uh, when it comes to self, when it comes to relationships, um, work, all that fun stuff. And we'll keep it light, right? We want to laugh some. And I'll be honest, y'all will probably like crack up just by watching these sometimes because, hey, it's LaShawn. And LaShawn doesn't like to be completely serious but I know there are things that we have to take seriously so sometimes you know I may throw some Lashanism words out there that totally does not make sense and it is okay to laugh with me it's even okay to laugh when I'm not laughing because trust me I'm probably laughing inside okay and and love yeah love is huge for me you guys so you know we have so much going on right now uh in the world where there's it seems like hate is 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 creeping up and winning all the time but i refuse to believe that so everything that we talk about that is said in the comments below and i hope you guys comment below please i would love to have those conversations with you um will be done with and in love because that's the only way my world goes around is with love and as i get on here and i talk and we have these words that are definitely coming from the universe coming from the creator coming from my god um we will you know they will be in and with love so yay i'm excited i'm excited for this episode i'm excited to do these wednesday talks and i uh hope and pray that you guys whoever tunes in you receive exactly what it is that you're supposed to receive in the episodes that you tune into so let's get started okay i hope everyone it is wednesday i hope everyone has their wine i have my wine i'm gonna take a sip Mm. Um, so, uh, a little bit more about me. I am, what you see is what you get. Okay. So I, um, don't, can't, and don't know how to be fake. So I'll stumble all, um, over my words. That is. <laughs> I don't want you to think I'm drinking too much wine and just stumbling around here. No, no, no. I'll stumble over my words. Um, like I say to people pretty much all the time, the only thing that you may find fake is the hair that I put in my head and the lashes. But a girl has to have her lashes and her lips. Lashes, lips, and nails have to be together. That's, you know, that's it. And hair. Hair has to be together too. But hair, I'm not a hair person. Anyway, that's enough story. So anyway, we're going to go ahead and get started with episode one. Um, episode one, my question for you guys is, how are you living? So how are you living? I want to know. I want you to put it down in the comments how you are living. Like, are you living in your purpose? If you are living in your purpose, what is that? I am so curious to know that about you. I really am. And if if anyone, you know, for those who know me, go ahead and help the ones that don't know me understand that I am the kind of person that says, hey, how are you? And <laughs> I'm going to wait until you give me an answer. And, and if we are going by each other and I'm like, hey, how are you? And I don't hear anything. And trust me, some, I, I am a little deaf sometimes. So <laughs> you may have said fine, okay, mm, or whatever. And I may not have heard it. I will stop. I will bag it up. And I'll say, oh, when I ask how you're doing, I really mean it. <laughs> I've done that to people. And they're like, 
oh, some, I catch completely off guard and some were like, oh, I said I'm good, I'm fine. I was like, okay, just didn't hear you. I wanted to make sure, you know, you know that I truly care. So I say all that to say, when you put a comment out there um, in, the, in my, um, under any of my episodes, I am going to look at them and I am going to have dialogue with you. So, yes, please comment and let me know, you know, especially when I start a, a, a episode off with a question, go ahead and answer it. So, um, like I said before, how are you living? Are you living in your purpose? Are you living life on purpose? That means you're not asking permission. You're not mistakenly here. You are here for a purpose, with a purpose, on purpose. How about that? Well, as you're thinking about your answer um, to my question, I'll let you know my little story, my life, how I'm living. Uh, first of all, I know, I'm, I've known for quite a while what my purpose is, and my purpose truly is to help people, help people help themselves. So um, for a long, long time before I knew better, I would help people and I would just enable them, you know, and then as I grew and of course gotten older and wiser, <laughs> I learned that's not helping anybody when I enable them. So my true purpose is to help people help themselves. I've gone through so many things, so many things, so many not so great things. And in my youth, it was pity party and it was a uh, victim mentality. And when I say my youth, I mean young, young teenage youth. But when I got in my like mid to late twenties, I had to grow up fast. So when I got in my mid to late twenties, I realized I can't be a victim, but I didn't know how to not be one. You know what I mean? So as I continue to grow and learn, and educate myself and seek positivity and seek the rewards and that are out there for LaShawn and seek and live in expectation, then I realized, okay, I'm not a victim. I'm a victor. And my purpose is not only to help people help themselves, is to show people how to get through what I've been through because people go through things and they feel like they're the only ones that have, that have gone through it. People feel like they're on an island by themselves and I, w I was that person. So how dare me to not get out there and give the advice that needs to be given, give the hug that needs to be given, have, give the listening ear that needs to be given and, and, and show empathy and show people that you can get to the next level. You will not be in this place this time next year. You, you, you think about the right things and you align yourself up to those positive things, then those things will happen for you. So that's how I, that's how I know that that is my purpose. I know I did not go through everything I went through for it to stay with me. There was a, I was listening to a, to a podcast, Cheryl Woods, Dr. Cheryl Woods, and she said something that just stuck with me. She said, your story is not for you. And I think she said something else that went with it, but that's the piece that stuck with me. It was like, when she said it at first, I was like, this one story is new for me. How dare Dr. Cheryl Woods tell me my story ain't for me? But then I started listening to her more, and it goes back to what has been placed in my spirit. Everything that I've gone through, it's not for me. It's for the next woman like me that's been through what I've been through. You see what I'm saying? It's for me to tell someone else, I've been through that. I've been through that. I empathize with you. And this is how I got through that. 
It's not about me walking around here like, oh, I got it all together. Uh, I was on what? Welfare? What? No. I was on welfare. And this is how I got off of it. You see what I'm saying? I was single. And with prayer, God brought me my husband. I have gone through <laughs> with my husband. And when we decided to come together, come together and be on the same page and listen to one another and help each other through our struggles, we got through. So am I saying I did it perfectly? Mm -mm. I got those stories too. And I gladly share all my imperfections. Because there's a lot of them. <laughs> so, I'm just here to say, you know, find your purpose. Know how you're living. And then go live that life that you've been blessed to live on purpose. So, I just want to Thank you guys for joining me for a lovely Wednesday Wine and Word. And I hope to see you next Wednesday. Be blessed. Cheers.